Okay, so here we are on day 55, and I don't know what time it is, but um, I haven't been watching the game, and we just got attacked. So I've scouted out the area, and I know what troops are coming, so I'm getting planes ready, bombers ready, um, to launch rockets. I can't fire as the troops are on friendly ground. Well, not friendly, on hostile. Um, ground that doesn't belong to North Ruby Rail, so I can't fire the rockets to larger targets like these, although normally I would. So, at the moment, I'm just waiting for the troops to march forwards, and they're going to probably die in my forts. Um, my ear is just about ready to counterattack, and that's what's going to happen. I'm still scouting out because I want to know how much I'm going up against. I've started building light tanks to reinforce, and I should probably actually send that blazer job up here to scout out. Um, but I'm waiting for them to get in close, attack, and then the rockets will launch. So that's what's going to happen. Okay, so we're back roughly an hour later, and um, what's happening at the moment? Well, North Rail is attacking us up in Europe. Uh, battleships can't get through to attack those ships because South Argentina has ships in the way and we're at war with him. So I am was going to send some of my aircraft over there to patrol, but um, it was kind of, the system was being a little glitchy, so we were unable to do that. Um, anyway, um, troops disembarking... Um, up in the top of the screen I've um, fired rockets at them so hopefully that will take care of them. Um, we're also about to start recalling some of our uh, tactical bombers so we can use them to defend up in Europe. Uh, over in um, oh, the Middle East our defenses are holding strong although we haven't really been attacked. Our enemy does have a lot of artillery um, but uh, we should be able to deal with that with um, some patrolling planes. So that's what's happening at the moment. I believe we, we can hold defenses positions here, obviously because, like I said, I'm recording this two weeks after the event, so I kind of know what happens. So I'm not going to spoil anything. Um, but, uh, yeah, um, that's what's happening at this very point. Um, I'm bringing artillery forwards to fire, but they, uh, their artillery at this point has a lot better range than mine, so they can outrange us. But I get the feeling, um, based on what I know happens, is he is kind of issued all of these orders, then gone, um, you know, gone and done something else, uh, gone and lived his life, gone outside, gone to work, gone to school, and we'll see that because if I was him, if I knew there was rockets hanging towards my convoys, although it's too late for that convoy there, I would definitely try to do something to stop them. Um, so that's what's happening at the moment. I'm sending this destroyer out to patrol this area here. Uh, keeping control of that is uh, relatively important um, to stop ships coming in, or convoys rather, coming in. So I've also messaged um, Volga at this point. Asking him for right away, right of way, sorry, so I can counterattack North Rail. Uh, I already know how that goes, and um, in part two, you'll see how uh, his response basically. Um, so yeah, that's what's happening at the moment. I'm being careful uh, not to lose that naval bomber. I need them at the moment. Um, but if we have a look at the casualties already, we are already doing way better than him. Um, they may have throwing some tough punches and we may be on the defensive but this is where we want to be we want to be on the defenses for these I'm going to build some um, fortifications and I'll tell you now that uh, that's kind of a waste of resources because I don't even use it in the end um, but uh, those fortifications will be very vital in the future as they will act um, for defensive positions for rockets, air bases, aircraft for lots of stuff so at this point I'm sending tanks back because at this point in the night I'm actually about to go to sleep so I'm sending tanks back because I know that I'll get there in time and they will be kind of the last line of defense now you can see there that the aircraft are finally responsive and I'm going to have them patrol that area there uh, so thank you for watching I'll post the next part um, of week 8 very very soon it won't be too long from now